Welcome back to another really quick video on how to create Excel documents and what we're going to look at here is how to create cell formulas. So if we have if you have never worked with Excel before, uh, I'm just going to give you a little crash course on what cell formulas are. So let's say we want to add two numbers together. Let's say we have the number 46 in there. Then let's put a plus sign in there. Uh, 12, then equals to. And in the uh, <coughs> sorry, in the cell E1, we have we want to get the sum of A1 plus C1, so which is 46 plus 12. We just have to uh, write in equals to, and then the cell A1 plus the cell C1. And then we get the answer 50, uh, 58 because we know 46 plus 12 is 58. So that's the goal for our tutorial here. And the way we're going to start is uh, start it. We're just going to delete the last two cells we created in the last tutorial. And I'll just go ahead and copy the cell uh, five times. I'll call them cell 1, cell 2, cell 3, cell 4, and cell 5. The first one is going to be in column number 0, then column number 1, column number 2, then column number 3, and 4. And then let's set the cell 1 value to something like 56. Cell 2 set cell value let's give it a value like uh, uh, let's give it the plus sign so everyone knows we we are adding those numbers together then the number cell 3 and uh, not the number the cell cell 3 set cell value and let's give it a number like 199 or whatever you prefer Cell 4, set cell value, and give it the equal sign. And cell 5, dot set cell value. And let's make the same formula as before, so equals to A1 plus A3, ah, uh, not A3, C1. So let's see what happens. Let's run that. We don't get any error messages. Let's open up test1.xl and oh no. So it put all the numbers in the right place, but it didn't calculate for us what A1 plus C1 is. Well, let's see. There's a solution to that. So apparently it just took the string and put the string into there without even creating the formula. So instead of creating the cell value to a string, we have to set the cell value uh, formula to the uh, to the cell. So what the difference between set cell formula and set cell value is? Uh, the set cell formula is directly creating the formula, and for that we don't even need a, a an equal sign. We just need to type in a1 plus c1. And if we run that, we don't get any error messages. And if we open up Excel, we get the answer of 56 plus 199, which is 255. So that's basically how you create uh, cell formulas. Of course, if you have some yeah, you can uh, use all the other formulas as well, you know, so something like... Uh, no, let's, let's try this out. I'll just put in four, four values in there. Uh, and then we want to calculate the sum of those four numbers. The way we're going to do that is we just type in sum and then Let's say, uh, for, and that is from A1 to D1. So let's see if, if that one works as well. Uh, 
And hooray, that one works as well. So it takes the sum from A1 to D1. So that's how you create cell formulas. And I guess in the next tutorial we'll start uh, formatting cells, you know, giving it special sizes and giving it background colors and stuff like that. And so that's going to be far more awesome than maybe the formulas. So as always, thank you for watching. If you have any questions left, don't hesitate to ask them in the comment section below. And I really hope to see you soon again. Bye.